Hello guys, I am Mother and today's video I'll talk about this uh, Raspberry Pi 3 Module B. So first I'll talk about its specifications. So it has 1.2 GHz quad-core processor with 1 GB RAM. It is built in with uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. And here are four USB ports and it is the Ethernet port. Here it is the HDMI and it is for the micro USB and here it is for the camera and this one is for the LCA to connect it and here is the audio jack okay so to run the Raspberry Pi we will upload the its operating system but before this I will uh, talk uh, about its uh, casing right here I have this case and it is a micro SD card which this uh, Raspberry Pi 3 supports and uh, here is the USB cable for the Raspberry Pi so first we will put the Raspberry Pi into this casing right here So I have put it. Now it's time to insert the SD card to the Raspberry Pi. So before this, we will upload the program to the SD card. So I'm showing you how to upload that program. Let's see. So first, we will download the operating system for the Raspberry Pi. So, so we search raspberrypi.org. So we'll click on this. So now we'll click on the downloads. And here are the operating system for the Raspberry Pi. So we'll download the noobs. And here are two one noobs and the other noobs light. So I'll download the noobs. Uh, you can also download it on torrent, but I'll download it and zip. As I have already downloaded it, so I'll cancel it. And now we'll need to download SD card formatter. So click on this as record formatter. So a page like this will appear. Here scroll down and here are two for download SD card formatter for Windows and the other download SD card formatter for Mac. So if you are using Mac so download it for Mac and I'm using Windows so I'll download it for Windows. So here it is the license so I'll click on accept and I have uh, already downloaded it so I'll cancel this. Now I'm showing you the files sorry here 
So here is our SD card formatter. So let's install this. will take some time for that I'm pausing my video so click on next and I accept the terms and the license agreement and install this I have installed it. So now we will insert our SD card in my laptop. So now I will open this uh, here first. I will here. So I'll format the SD card and this make sure that uh, you have selected the SD card not the other drives. Click on format. And our SD card has formatted. Here you can see. So now we will uh, copy all the files of the operating system to the SD card so to extract this uh, to open this you will need a uh, vendor so I have downloaded it and installed it so I'll open it and here are all the files so click on extract to and here select your SD card and click OK so the extraction starts for that uh, it will take some time so for that I am pausing my video so it is done 98 percent and so it, uh, is, uh, so it is extracted now I'll open the SD card so here are the files now I'll reject the SD card and insert it to the Raspberry Pi so let's see how I install the operating system so now I will insert this SD card to the Raspberry Pi but uh, make sure that uh, this uh, surface toward the upper side of the the Raspberry Pi like this. So I have inserted it. Now I'll uh, put the USB cable here and and I'll put this uh, HDMI cable right here and I'll connect the keyboard and mouse to it and then I will connect it to the LCD so here are our keyboard and mouse so let's connect the mouse first uh, here like this and then the keyboard like this okay and here here is the vg cable from the lcd i have this uh, converter so I'll like this okay so now it is ready 
So I'll uh, plug this to the power supply and then I'm showing you on the LCD screen. So now I'll uh, plug it and so the screen appears. You can see the mouse turned on and it is searching for the threading system. So we'll uh, select the Raspbian here and click on the install. Before this, uh, you can change your keyboard layout and language right here. Uh, I have this, so I'll uh, install it. And this shows the warning. This will install the selected operating system. All existing data on the drive will be overwritten, including any operating systems that are already installed. So I'll click on yes. So now it will take uh, some time, about 20 minutes. So for that, I'm pausing my video. And when it is uh, going to complete, then I'm resuming it. Okay. So it is done about. So it is uh, installed successfully. I'll click on OK and the LCD will start. and it is started our Raspberry Pi is working with its operating system so now we will connect it to the Wi-Fi network here then it is turned off and I will turn it on like this so here is the Wi-Fi network I'll um, enter the password disconnected and here I'm showing you the menu here are the programs and this is the uh, office there's uh, internet, games, accessories, hard frequencies run shut down. And uh, now you can shut down from here. And there are three options. So I'll click on the shut down. And it is turning off. and it is turned off i hope that you have enjoyed the video and if you like this video so thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to enjoy more videos